All right, guys, so I just want to set up um, a quick demo video here for you guys to see um, how easy it is to use the BrainBlocks uh, app. Um, so to start out, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to set up a new payment account. Um, this is real simple and uh, easy to use. So as you can see, I already have uh, my payment account set up in there, but I'm going to go ahead and say update. Um, just so that way you guys can see. And then as soon as I lift this and show that QR code, it's going to say code found. Um, this is going to tell you exactly what code it found, and then you can say, yes, that's the correct one, or no, it's not. Um, this is going to prevent, or hopefully prevent, incorrect entries. So I'm going to go ahead and say, yes, it is, since it is the correct one. And now it's set. And then I'm going to transition over to my computer now. Guys, I'm back on my computer now. Um, so I'm going to show you how easy it is to use um, payments inside BrainBlocks. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and click on here. I'm going to enter payment real quick. Um, and then it's going to generate a temporary session. Um, that session does last 120 seconds um, before it cancels and times out. But as you can see, I have that temporary address here. So this is the address that you're going to want to send it to, uh, send your payment to. Um, that address does change um, with every transaction. But I'm going to go ahead and copy that address here. Just give me a second. And I'm going to open up my wallet and send it. Sorry, I don't have that in the screen here, but I'm... I just sent the payment and we're gonna wait just I don't know a couple seconds here and then it'll, you should see that it'll say payment successful um, that it did receive that payment hopefully it doesn't take too long here and there you go so it does say payment successful um, so it really wasn't too hard um, and I don't you can't see it but um, that payment did already start coming back to me. Um, I have, as you can see right here, I have my payment account set up, so um, it's already sent it back, uh, which is really nice. It doesn't doesn't wait any time at all. Um, so as soon as you pay, that the person that's supposed to get paid will get paid almost instantly as well. And then over here, um, this is something that I'm just setting up now. Um, it's kind of like the uh, store or shop uh, example. Um, we are using it as donations, but um, it's really just to display the uh, the ease of use of the SDK. So here I can click on, these are all USD values. Um, so let's click on uh, pay $3 and it will automatically convert it into uh, Rayblox and it will generate the session uh, based on that payment. Um, and then it sends it to our donation account. So I'm going to go ahead and cancel that payment. And then let's try another one. Um, $20. You see that it, it did change the value to match. So that's just a quick demo. Um, I hope it helps people understand uh, kind of where things are right now with the app. Um, I am open to any suggestions if you are willing to, you know, uh, let me know. That would that would really help. Um, thank you guys.